2% of women of age 45 who participate in routine screening have breast cancer. So 2% of the women have breast cancer. And of them, 90% of those with breast cancer have positive mammographies. And 10% of the women who do not have breast cancer will show positive mammographies. Given that a woman has a positive mammography, what is the probability that she has breast cancer? So we are doing conditional probability here where one event is that the woman has breast cancer. And the other event is that the mammography is positive. So, positive mammography. And what we are looking for is basically P of A given B, which is essentially P of A intersection B divided by P of B. Now we know P of B is affected by both people having breast cancer and not having breast cancer. So people having breast cancer is 2%, so 0 0.02 and of them 90%, that is 0.9, show up positive mammographies and that gives us 0.018 and in the remaining cases of the 98% who do not have breast cancer, 10% show positive mammographies. So that gives us, so that is 0 0.1, that gives us 0 0.098. This is the total probability of a mammography showing positive. So that would be P of B. So we have 0 0.018 plus 0 0.098. And of them, the A intersection B case is this, having breast cancer and having a positive mammography is this case, which is 0 0.018. So, we will have, this is equal to 0 0.018 divided by 0 0.116. And that is roughly equal to 0 0.0.1552. So, this is the conditional probability of a woman who is given positive mammography having breast cancer. And it is pretty low. Thank you.